Click. I'm gonna turn this light on. Is it good? Shit. It's better. Turn it back off. What's better? Is it better like this or the other way? Let me wipe my camera off. This? Oh shit, the fuck? Okay, y'all, we finna get into some tea because we trying to figure out what the hell is going on. Now, y'all, it's been some things that's been said all on social media about this particular this particular situation. But, y'all, we trying to figure out what's the tea, okay? Um, we not going to curse. We not going we not going to get nasty in here. We just going to keep it calm, cool, collective. We want to know what's the tea. Y'all, no shade. Nadia and Oreo's been going back and forth for a while. We don't know exactly what's the reason why they're going back and forth, but insights got behind closed doors that I got a message that Nadia is really mad because Oreo was messing with somebody that she was messing with. This is just a rumor. Not too sure how true it is. Not too sure. But this is what I got told from somebody else that does not even be in a loop like that. So is that the reason why Nadia is really mad? Or is Nadia really mad because Oreo just simply don't want to be her friend? Because Oreo get talked about every shade. No shade. So let's welcome Oreo to the stand. Hey, Oreo. Hi. Hey, so I don't even know why I'm doing you real quick for the growth that we have seen when it comes to you. You've been ignoring situations after situations, dodging bullets, been staying true to the Lord and everything that comes around. And I'm so proud of you on your journey of growth. Don't let nobody knock you down. We have seen you try to ignore the situation for damn near weeks. We've seen that you have not spoke to social media. Anything bad about Nadia has messed with her name, her image, or anything else. You just kept it cool, calm, collective. Apparently, from what I'm told, you guys had a sit-down video. Everything you told her is the same thing you said in your video. Now it's being misconstrued as if it's something that, was, that wasn't that was said outside of the YouTube video. So I'm confused. Where do you think this animosity is being held up at? Cause okay, so I want to start off by saying, like, we had a sit-down talk in person off camera. We did, mm -hmm. but the video I made was pre-recorded. So I guess it kind of caught her off guard that I made a video, but at the same time, I was kind of caught off guard myself because she made a video. I, I didn't go on the internet and address nothing. People said I made a shady post first. I did not make a shady post. I did not know me posting about isolation was talking about a specific person. Mm -hmm. No, and I'm not going to lie. The stuff that like she's going through right now, I, I would never see her and try to downplay because at one point I was just like that. I was, I was in different like relationships. Like I was dealing with, uh, friendships. Like I was hella toxic on the internet and y'all can watch for me. I was messy as fuck. Like I'm not gonna lie. So it's just like, I don't want that for myself no more. Like that's, I don't know. I had a, I don't know. I had a spiritual awakening. Just like you I'm tired. There's nothing wrong with a change. With the change. It, exactly. So that's what I'm, I'm dealing with myself. I don't want. Uh, I don't want to keep talking to different dudes all the time. I don't want to keep having having sex. I don't want to keep doing that. I don't want that for myself no more. So mm. we just like, it's it's a problem that I want to change, and I I want what's best for her. So in my video, I did not bash the girl. I ain't say nothing. I said, um, just like. No, like it's basically like a know your worth thing. Don't like you don't have to be around the people that you talked about. Like these people will hurt you. And me being your friend, it was there for you twenty four seven through it all. And that shit hurt me. The people that's hurting you hurt me. And I would never get cool with the people that that hurt you. Cause like shit, you my twin. We're like this. So it was mm. like if people hurt you, you hurt they, they hurt me. So for you to go back to them, it was like damn. Like, what did I get into it with? Yeah, like, even being around people that said something about her miscarriage, made fun of her miscarriage, being the same ones that call her bops, putting her business underneath certain pages, making it seem as though they're just support pages that just knows the tea and all types of stuff. 
it just really goes to show why would you want to be around a group of people that has nothing bad but to say about you especially when you fall out with them so and it's it just like and it, and it kind of like hurt my feelings be, because too like it's some stuff that like i would still take to the grave and i don't care like i would never let y'all know like get down to the t like even if we was to fall out if she was to like go on the internet because i i did this with a previous friend in the past she said something to me she brought up my past and i went back and did it to her i scooped out to her level but mm -hmm. i was like w there's no good in that and that like kind of like painted a bad like damn i really scooped out to her level but now i learned that like if she was to go on the internet and say whatever because we both got dirt on each other on god like we can really like crash down for real for real but me the kind of character i have now I'm not finna go on the internet and tell her business. I'm not doing that. Mm. I'm not. Like, I don't know. That's just, that's just like how, like, I'm built. Like, so for her to be like, oh, oh, I can say some shit. Like, she playing innocent. I'm not playing innocent. It just, I don't want that for myself no more. Like, and I said, like, we could be cool. We could be cordial. I never even bashed her in a video. If you want to be, if you watch the video, it was me taking a, accountability of what I was dealing with. And then that's when I said what comes with genuine friends, how I just want what's best for her. And I hope that me and her can have a sit down talk one day and boom, it came afterwards, but it was pre-recorded. And I, everything that I said in the video, um, I said to her and key, and I guess, I don't know, like I said what I said. So where, so where does it come about? Because in the conversation that I had got, you guys had a conversation in real life and basically you stated that you were on a better a better journey and that you were building your your growth up and things like mm -hmm. that and it just all came about of it being said that you were using god for an excuse but I, that's the thing and that kind of like threw me off too like using god as an excuse to get better who else is going to heal us what are you talking about without mm -hmm. god i am nothing and that's why i'm saying like you got to be like real humble so like that kind of like threw me off a little bit and mm -hmm. a lot of people are saying that i'm using god as an excuse when when you actually give your life to god i'm telling you everything is gonna be so much better like for real and that's only that's for spiritual people if you know what i'm talking about you know so it's just like i don't know using god as an excuse is kind of like weird but like i don't know that's that's some spiritual now behind closed doors there was something else that was being said because this came from uh someone else i can't you know disclose no names but a rumor has been said that she's really upset because you have relations of someone that she was dealing with or you did something to I someone don't have, that she was i don't have no relationships with nobody if she's talking about rod me and rod are friends we literally just met and we made a video like it's content she know how content works and after that like i won't do no videos with rod and that's why i was like you know what i'm not even gonna make a situation bigger than what it is because people gonna try to make it seem like that i'm going after somebody that she dealt with and like i'm tired of that i'm no so i won't be making no videos but and what i thought was she, i guess in her video with um oh uh, i don't like seeing his name because like yeah but I guess you were talking about Taina with the whole like sharing clothes thing and like her, she wasn't talking about me mm. with that. So, yeah, but if she feel like I was dealing with someone that she dealt with, she's not here. She's not here. That's number one. Y'all keep telling me to add the girl. She's not here. Okay, go ahead. I'm sorry. But yeah, I feel like it was it was never about me. But like if it if she talking about a dude, I don't I don't have no relationships with nobody. Okay, mm -hmm. so I'm chilling. As you should. So I had got in my exclusive chat because they texted to me in my exclusive chat. They said that she mentioned your abortion in the comments, but she deleted it. How do you feel about that if that is true? Because I'm not sure if it's true. Uh, let me see. Somebody said that they was going to send me a screenshot. Can somebody send that to me just for confirmation so that we won't be sitting right here saying that that is that and the third? I just want to know for sure if it's true. Because if she did say that that's low key really effed up mm. um and but it's just like it's like a it's a and even if she did it's a repeated cycle because the last friend said that too so why are y'all throwing some that i've dealt with that i share with y'all on a on a different connection mm. why are y'all telling that to the internet i'm not gonna go tell y'all business so why do y'all right. why do y'all feel the need to like 
Yeah, we, we like, even um, though we already knew like about that last year. Yeah, we we knew about that, but the thing about it is just still the fact that it's coming from a friend that you consider. Mm -hmm. So even if it it doesn't need to, whatever's been said in the past does not need to be re reformed to the surface, especially if you're my yeah. friend and is being re you know announced. That's low key weird. Um, mm -hmm. especially they say that she didn't say that, but. I don't know. They keep telling me that she said it. She didn't say it. She said it. She said it. She didn't. Send me the screenshot of her saying it. That's what I'm saying. If she said it, if she said it, okay, cool. You saying like everybody know that already, but just mm. like if she did, like right. I'm not That's... going to. I'm not like I'm not finna. I'm not doing. Well, do you see yourself being that cool with Nadia? I ain't and... gonna lie. Like now to the point, like I see, like when you, I will really think like that she would want good for her friend, you know what I'm saying? Like, cause I actually genuinely like love that girl. But like, it's just like, everybody can't go on the same path as you. Everybody on different paths. Everybody grow up, uh, grow from each other. So it's just like, there's nothing that I can do. It's, it was cool. It was, you know, like we click like this, like, but it just, I'm on some different shit, you know what I'm saying? And that's what, that's what was said in the actual sit down that you had with this girl. Yeah. So cool. I see that a lot of people are upset with you in the comments, but comments, can I ask you guys a question? What's wrong with outgrowing someone in a friendship? Can we normalize outgrowing someone in a friendship? And sometimes there could be a slight change in yourself that maybe you just get tired of being around certain individuals. Like, let's just say, for example, I hung out with people that does nothing but just smoke and literally smoke their lives away. Y'all are going to be upset at me because I want to change and I don't want to be around that no more. Because if I be around it, I'll pick up the bad habits that they'll only bring to the table. What are you bringing to me that's honestly good? Now, it's okay for you to want me there by your cause and you need me there for you. But what are you ever going to be there when it comes for me? Because me and you can't relate if I'm on to a new journey and I'm trying to grow within myself. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm kind of not understanding what's going on. And it's like... I don't know if like it was like me like being like blunt with that, but it was just like um, I didn't really too much open up like the whole not answering the phone thing. It was just our, like I said in the video that um, I wasn't answering the phone because you was around something that had too much going on. Of course, like I will open up to you and tell you like what I'm going through and what I feel like is within me, but you never responded to me. I sent you a long ass message like this like like this and you left me on deliver and then that's when oh we got to have a talk in person and i'm like okay all right let's have a sit you made a video i'm like damn i thought we was gonna have a talk in person oh so the video got made before the actual sit down in person yeah with her video oh and then you just made one right after her video then but yeah after the sit down Mm -hmm. no, okay. no, 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 no. I made a, I made a video before the sit down, but okay, when she said, after the sit down, um, I had sent her a long message and she was like, we're going to talk in person. But then she made a YouTube video and I was like, damn, I thought we was going to talk in person. So, but my video, it wasn't more so like tagging at her, but like, it was like, it kind of like summed it up with everything. But Ooh. like, that's when. After I recorded my video, and that's when she reached out and was like, oh, let's have, uh, we, we can meet in person. And I was like, all right, cool. And we met in person, but my video was already recorded. So it was like, my video was going to be regardless. You know what I mean? Okay. Saying? So you were rebuttaling at her video that she already had made, but then she said, let's do the sit down. I did the sit down, but you still posted it because people, yeah. it's just still the internet is looking at yeah, you. Yeah, and like it was just thing. like me, like, I want to say clearing up my name, but it was just like my, my supporters wanted to know, like, or like what's what's been going on within you? Why you been out the way, type B? Mm. So now they they keep telling me to add key, y'all. These people that y'all are telling me to add, they are grown as hell and they know how to get up in a request box. If I see them up in the request box, I have no problem adding them. But right now they're not in a request box. Y'all keep telling me to add them. They're not in a request box. This is not Instagram. The pe key and whoever else is with her. 
They're not a request. I don't even think Key was with them. Oh, Maybe. somebody said, oh, let me clear this up. Somebody said I was in a room with Eli with the door locked, first of all. This was a whole misunderstanding. Like, Nadia, I was texting Nadia while I was in a room, and I was telling her to come in a room. And some, she was, I guess she was trying to open the door, and Eli can vouch. I swear to God, I was in his life to Eli. Me and Eli didn't do nothing with each other, and nothing happened. Sw sweat, like, I don't even want to, yeah, but didn't do nothing with that boy, so I guess she's trying to make the situation, like, make it, make me seem like the bad guy, but I never did nothing I do, like, at all. Like, I'm not one of those, so. Mm. So they tried to make it seem like you did something with Eli now? Yeah. Lord, hold up. I'm kidding. They said Key telling me to add her. Y'all, Key's not in a request. Kicking it with Key? I don't... So do you have... Okay, so this is what the people want to know. Do you have an issue with Key too? Mm-mm. No, I don't have an issue with Key. My okay. thing was, I was just like, mm -hmm. I didn't... Like, I was kind of confused when she, like, put her input, like, on the on the video. Right, because you would have thought that. Okay, so you so from the back, and it seems like a couple people had an input to put. How do you feel about these couple of people that had an input to put, but you're supposed to be cool with them? It just like it just seemed like, damn, was it really like was y'all really fucking with me for real? Like, I thought our issue was me and Nadia had an issue, quote unquote issue. Like, mm. I didn't know like it was like y'all. Like a y'all thing. You thought it was just you and the Nadia thing. Yeah. Okay, yeah, that's it. Okay, so they keep telling me to add the girl. I don't see her. Okay, hold up. Damn, like, they keep telling me to add her, and they act like the fuck I'm, I'm not blind. I, I know how to add people. But let's welcome the one and only, Nadia, since she's being the one to... The one and only. Nadia. I'm going to go on mute. Go ahead. Um, it wasn't Nadia. It was Key. Sorry. Oh, it's key. Oh, hold on, wait. Okay, hey, key. Let me, let me turn the camera on. Hold on. Is the camera on? Yes. Okay. Hey, Mudge. Hey. So, how's it going? Um, it's going good. Um, I just wanted to get on here and um, I'm not speaking on half, but um, Nadia, because you feel me. Like I said, that's but like you feel me, and I even told you that, Ori. Um, I will say this, and Ori, please don't say anything while I'm talking. Just let me get it out. You feel me? Because I know you like to like. Oh, yeah. Cool. So, I I never once, oh, and this is on my little sister, and I'll put it on God. I, I will swear to God. I never once chose a side when y'all was beefing, and I even told you that when we sat down. Whenever y'all had y'all little whatever y'all call yourself doing, I was even telling Nadia, you need to talk to her. You feel me? I even told you when we sat down and talked, I even hate to be in that position because you're like my sister, and that's my best friend. The reason why y'all even got back cool was because of me. I literally... Never once put myself in your situation. When you posted that TikTok about, I guess, what Nadia posted after we got to the fight, which really wasn't even about you. It wasn't, had nothing to do with you. It wasn't a slug at you. None of that. You don't even like the fucking picture. That's the only thing. But anyways, when all that was going on, he's the only person keeping the medium. Even the whole Eli thing. When when you called me, because you called me, you called me and was like, Key, bruh, get Nadia. Nadia tripping on me, bruh. You, you told me, to, you, she thinking I'm in the room doing something with Eli. Did you not? Did. So, I, I text Nadia like, the hell going on? You feel me? Like, I'm even telling her like, bruh, you might be tripping. Just, you feel me? Just, you feel me? Like, and like I tell both of y'all, if anything is true or anything does happen, I tell y'all, if anything, it'll unravel itself. You feel me? And what's done in the dark always comes to the light. It does. You feel me? I even told, I told her, I was like, you feel me? Like, you probably tripping, you feel me? Like, I don't think, Ori, you feel me? Because we like this. Not going to think that. When y'all got into it over social media, over the freaking post, I even said, y'all just need to talk in person. Then, not to mention, and maybe, and yeah, this was before the your video was before we sat down and talked, which is the only reason why I got at you because I was a little confused. But um, I asked you in person, and you keep saying I'm lying, but this is on my little sister. I put it on Jesus Christ himself. And y'all know I don't have nothing to lie about. Okay, go ahead. I'm not done. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, I have go ahead. nothing to lie about. I have nothing to lie about. Y'all know I'm go not ahead. going to lie. Maj, if anybody know, you know Key going to keep it real. And everybody in the comments know Key going to keep it real. I always do. We sat at that table. And while you mm -hmm. and Nadia was talking, first of all, I'm helping y'all talk it out. Because it really would have been a dry-ass conversation. It would have been about one thing. I'm helping y'all talk out mm -hmm. everything. Everything. From, from beginning to now. You feel me? 
I literally asked you in the middle of y'all conversation. I said, did you feel like, you feel me, like I was picking sides or anything? I was like, because if you do, you feel me, like it wasn't like that on God. You feel me? I just spoke on the TikTok. That was literally all I did. You can. You've never seen and then, me on a okay, podcast. And then listen, no, and that's what, and that's what, what, and that's what kind of got me because when can you I talk, can I talk, video, just give me a second. Just give me a second. Just give I me said, a second. no, I didn't have a problem. I was kind of confused because we supposed just to be like this. But I don't know, you know why you put Corey, your input in the video. Corey, you only talk about me because you know I'm going to keep it real. So just let me have it, please. No, go ahead. Okay, please. That's all I'm asking. I'm giving <laughs> you a respect. Give me my. Like, <laughs> at that table. Yeah, it, it really is funny. Oh, God. So I sat at the table while y'all were talking and I said, if you feel like I was, you feel me, like picking sides, that was never the case. I didn't get you the rundown. I said, I was the one who told Nadia to talk to you. Y'all need to sit down and have a conversation. I told you, like I said, I hate to even be in a position. Y'all put me, y'all both putting me in a weird situation. Nadia's right here. I can say anything to anybody. I don't care. You feel me? Both of y'all put me in a weird situation, but I still remain neutral. Even when I got on live and people say, and when this is when you and Nadia first started being distant with each other, I'm on live. People asking me, what's up with you and Ori? Like, you and Ori good? I'm telling them. No, Ori like my sister. What y'all talking about? You feel me? Because that's not my business. What y'all got going on, I try to mend it. Y'all grown women. I can't force y'all to talk. I can't force y'all to sit down. And I cannot force y'all to feel a different way about each other. Y'all got to do that yourself. But I asked you at the table. I was like, if you felt like I was picking sides, you said, no, I never thought that. Picking, si picking sides and putting your input is like, you, not, you never picking sides and putting your input like, is like, like not the same thing. I'm just trying to get it out for a second. You can talk when I'm done, I promise. Like, I, I swear like to God. Like, you, like, you, like, you're, like you're going in circles. No, because you can, because be quiet. I mean, just let me talk, please. That's what I'm saying. Just let me talk. Like I said, I keep going in circles. I keep getting interrupted. I sat at the table, asked you, you said, and you keep saying that you said, oh, no, I'm just confused. You never brought up the YouTube video thing. You never brought that up. And that's all my little sister. I don't know if you remember or if that's what you want people to believe, but you never said that. And that's all my baby. Why y'all trying to like, why y'all trying to make it seem like I don't bring, I literally said when you, I said, I don't like how you put your input because you was like, I never said I had a problem. I never said that you pick sides. I'm like, I just don't like how you put your input input because I was kind of confused. You said that in your Putting video. Input in that choosing me. sides is two quit different quit things. Quit I never feel like that you felt some kind of way about me. I never said that. But, but if our thing is you never if you said that. If you keeping it neutral, listen, listen, listen. If you keeping it neutral, you wouldn't have said nothing. But the TikTok you know that she posted, it, we felt like... Keep, but, what, but who is okay, we? Wait, That's what I'm saying. Y'all making it a we problem. Let me, let me ask you a question. So you started feeling some type of way because the TikTok that she posted, you felt like it was a slug towards yeah, I thought, you. Yeah, I thought it was a slug towards me and Nadia, but Nadia, so I didn't even see did the TikTok. So how recent was the TikTok? It was right after we... It was right after Nadia posted about um, the thing she posted with me and Ida. But that was only because we had fought with Nadia. So she was just saying, you feel me? A little appreciation post. Okay, it, so like so it was when I was after... talking, it was just like, there was just, I felt like my feelings was getting about, like, y'all was telling me, oh, no, it, um, you shouldn't feel like it. But it was like this. And I was like, but that's how I see it, though. Okay, hold like, up, Oreo. So wait, was the, was the TikTok after the sit down or before the sit down? This is no the TikToks was way the TikTok is way before that. Okay, so therefore why y'all ain't put it on the flow? I mean, I personally feel like if you personally felt some type of way about the TikTok that was being made, why did you wait after the sit down to address it when you could have addressed it when y'all had the sit down in person? You was a part we, of the sit did. down in person, so correct? That's what, that's what I'm saying. We did. The thing that's when we said something about TikTok. And I, and I said that. I said, I thought I said the, the only TikTok, thing I the TikTok that I made was about isolation. I did not know isolation was about y'all. But you cleared that at the sit down. You didn't clear that before that. But but I didn't clear nothing up though. When we sat at the table, when we had no our shade, she did no shade, she did, and she ignored it. She did not. I'm gonna be honest. Oreo have not gave a response until the actual YouTube video. And right. now, right. if she did, it must have felt some type of way that y'all felt like she was throwing shade in TikToks, comments, or likes. Right. right, because that's the point that y'all are having this disagreement with you and Oreo, not mm -hmm. Oreo and Nadia. Yeah, no, so this year, if, yeah. So, yes, if this was the case, anything that you felt then or there, you should have put it on the flow when right. y'all was at that sit down car, right. wherever y'all was at conversating, because 
from the looks of it, it seemed like this could have already been talked about when y'all already and that's had. That's what I told meeting. them. That's what I literally told them. I said y'all should have been sat down. We could have been pre preventing all of this. You feel me? But, 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 but I tried to talk to y'all. I tried to talk. I said the long ass. You didn't try to talk to me. Nobody responded to me though. Don't talk to me. You, you know my phone broke, so you. I don't know. Like I said, I don't be in y'all mix. Like I said, I'm not gonna keep telling y'all to talk to each other. So I didn't really know too much about the whole. You feel me? Texting. I don't really know too much about that. That's like I said. Yes, I'm saying. Everybody think I be dick riding Nadia, but I really do not be in their business. I can. I'm only tell y'all once. You feel me? Okay. Now, 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 now. Hold up. You know I'm a real ass nigga, Key. You know I fuck with you. I'm a Key. So? I love, I love you. Okay. Keep you know I love you, me. So I love me some Key too. But Key, this is the point that they're trying to make. Mm -hmm. If you personally feel like you wanted to have a sit down with Nadia, you wouldn't have had waited till Nadia wanted to have the sit down with Oreo. You would have scheduled your own date to have a sit down with Oreo because now it seems like okay, we gonna move based off how Nadia moving. If you, mm -hmm. I call Oreo Oreo y'all because we go way back. So mm -hmm. let me just start off by saying that. that's what I'm but saying. Like if me and you sisters key and we and I call you, I call you without without Nadia around and mm -hmm. I'm key. I miss you. Yeah. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I want to talk to you. I talked to you when when you was at home. I'm calling you. Right. Like, we, me and you chopping up on the phone. So if mm -hmm. it was a problem, I feel like you should have let me know. Mm -hmm. oh, or is this um, TikTok about me? And I would have told mm -hmm. you right in and there. Hell no. Nah. Because right. y'all two having an issue. Y'all two having an issue that has nothing to do with Nadia. And I'm glad that y'all both understand that. Yeah, I feel That's like the, cool. I feel like the, situ like the situation between me and you is kind of like just dumb. Like. And, and 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 that's and that's a that's cool to you know state that and I honestly feel like that's that is true. But I personally feel like y'all could have been had y'all meeting. Right. Y'all both like y'all didn't even have to tell nobody if y'all two had an issue with each other and y'all was friends like this. Oh, you know what? Let me call Oreo real quick. Oreo, what's going on? Let's right. meet up. Let's go get some brunch. We gonna sit down. We gonna have a conversation. Don't nobody need to know we talk because what's understood don't need to be explained. Y'all could have been hashed y'all situation out. No, yeah. And that's just me being honest. That, that and, I, and I respect that you for me. And, and that's why I felt some kind of way, which like I was like, damn, can you hurt my feelings? Because why you put your input if I ain't even know like that you was feeling like that? Because I ain't know. I'm mm -hmm. like, damn. You know what I'm saying? And that's, and that's why, why I said to video, you, like, that's why it kind of, when I seen the video and you was like, you feel me, like, Key, what's up? Like, you feel me? I, I was like, damn, we just talked and I asked you, you feel me, how you was feeling? You feel me? And you didn't say that. That's only, that's the only reason why I got mad. Cause like I said at the table, you didn't say nothing about the TikTok. You didn't say nothing about me putting my input. You just told me, you was like, oh no, no, I wasn't thinking like that. No, I you told y'all, like, I told y'all how the TikTok looked to me. And we told you how the TikTok looked to us too. It no, was a misunderstanding. That's what, but that, yeah, and I, that's what we said. Bro, my, I it was a misunderstanding. Understanding. But that's I think, I think was getting to. Is it because I posted a video? Like what but, you mean? Like is it like is the problem that I posted a video? Because like after that, it was done. Like after literally like five minutes after I posted a video, you called me. It yeah. was like. Oh, what well, this like, is like you like you was on hot shit. And I'm like, I was on hot because I'm like, damn, we just talked. Mind you, I didn't but, know the video was pre recorded, but pre recorded. And, and that's the thing. And, like, and this will happen with y'all too. But y'all y'all made a video about y'all took. I didn't made a video, video about, about me. You, I ain't no shit. But we was. I ain't made no video about you. I ain't made no video about you. And I, I made mean, like, you, like video you, you talked in the video, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I talked in the video, but I only I addressed the TikTok part. You feel me? Cool. My apologies. You feel me? Like, like my shit, I could have sat down and talked it up with you about that one on one. Mm -hmm. I didn't know that video was pre-recorded, but even though it was pre-recorded, it still kind of was like, damn, well, a lot of stuff she said in the video wasn't said at the table. And I was like, okay, so you feel me? Did we really soft? Like, is everything really soft? Are we really good? Mind mm -hmm. you, I just got to talk and we all hugged big as hell. Like, you feel me? Like, felt like we finna, you feel me? Like, work on just- But like, like, okay, let me know something that I didn't say at the table. I just told you. And like I said, I say what you, what you didn't say to me. Now, you and Nadia, y'all can have that talk, you feel me? But yeah, I'm sure. talking about us too. Yeah. All but, you did say but I, like I said, I was like, you hurt my, like, I was like, damn, we supposed to be like this. And you answered yourself in the video. That's mm -hmm. why, that's, that's all I said. Mm -hmm. That's all I said to you. So the only reason why I had made a comment, well, only reason I was even in the video, because the video wasn't about you, by the way. And you, if you watch the video, then you know, the video like wasn't made about you. I was asking the questions. Nadia asked me, we had just gotten to Houston. And she was like, you feel me? Like. Can you ask me these questions? I'm cool. I'm just reading off the thing. When she adjusts, when she adjusts, I, that's when I said something about the TikTok. Oh, God. You feel me? Like I said, I apologize because I could have came to you personally. You feel me? But also thinking that we're going to sit down and talk. I was like, well, I'll just see it when I see it. You feel me? Mind y'all, I brought my phone too. So like, I haven't really had no, y'all know, I've been tapping off a of big body Benz, iPad 3000. You feel me? So 
I've been chopping <laughs> off that thing, you feel me? I ain't got no phone right now, you feel me? Mm-hmm. And I'm not finna sit and act like, you feel me? I got one, I don't. And I even told you that when we sat at the table, I was like, if you feel like I was being distant or weird, that wasn't the case. If you called me and I didn't answer, that was why. And my phone broke literally while we were at the 30, the 30 days straight thing. So I, I've literally been almost too much out of phone. So like, you feel mm-hmm. me? Okay. Well, I, you know, I personally feel like y'all two has a misunderstanding. Do y'all personally see yourselves being back friends, you and Oreo, since y'all know, like, I personally feel like y'all had a friendship, but I don't think that y'all friendship really, you know, went down a drain as much as Nadia's and Oreo's did. Yeah, that's why I was like, damn. Because I'm like, damn, I wish we would see all this at the table, because you know I always tell you, Oreo, you feel me? We tell, first of all, we tell each other. Fuck that. You feel me? Like... If we anything, always be, we no matter, always know each other about everything. No matter if it hurt our feelings or not, you feel me? Tell me how how you feel on all aspects. You feel me? So when I seen the video and you were saying what you were saying, I was like, okay, damn, wait, she didn't say that at the table. Like you feel me? That's all I was saying. But but listen though, I tried to talk. Like I tried to talk to. Well, the I even know it was an issue with you. That's what I'm getting at. The issue was with Nadia, but it wasn't even an issue for real because. What I said when she was like on live saying, oh, Ori, don't answer the phone, type B. But after I seen the three out of three, um, three out of three thing, and mm-hmm. shit, we all had to talk. Shit, if, if shit go down with whoever, it's always going to be us three. So it was just like, when I seen that three out of three, shit, I was like, damn. But I was looking in the comments, like I told you, I was looking in the comments. And I'm like, people like, where Ori at? Where Ori at? And then people was like, oh, Nadi said Ori don't answer the phone. So that's what made me text Nadi and was like, oh, you said I don't answer the phone? And she was like, yeah, you pushing your real friends away. She, mm-hmm. And she was like, you pushing your real friends away. And if you look at her, and if you look at her caption, she I said, three out of three, the ones that never pushed me away. So I was like, damn, so that shit about me. So basically, I got kicked to the curb. And I was like, all right, cool. The most, and then I the see her long grab, told her how much I appreciate her, and I love her, and it's never no weird shit, and she never responded. Period. The most, I I seen between y'all, the most I seen between y'all was after the whole fight thing. So all, all what all that part I don't know, but after the fight thing, I seen all that. That's all I seen, and like I said, I never addressed it. That's not my business. You feel me? I tell you, I tell y'all like, if anything, first of all, we made a pact to each other. Y'all already know. Feel me? If we got a problem with each other, or we feel me, it's the type of way about each other. You feel me? Come and talk. You feel me? And granted, like I said, I didn't do that when the TikTok got posted. You feel me? I'm not no hypocrite. You feel me? I didn't do that, but you feel me? Like I just wrote like fuck the nice situation. That has nothing to do with me. I was just my more so problem was like. When I seen the video, I was like, damn, she didn't say it's at the table. That's the only thing I was confused about. That's it. Okay, case closed. Y'all back mm-hmm. friends or y'all cool with y'all cordial? It never was an issue. And that's why I was irritated at the fucking video, because it never was an issue. Okay, well, I think y'all honesty is cool. I don't think it should be no issue, no beef, no, you know, it was just a misunderstanding, but we want the real tea. What's up with Nadia and Ori? That's what we trying to figure out. Nadia, we know you getting your lashes done. We seen you, but my only thing about it is all these YouTube videos that's being made, we want to clock the tea, baby. What's going on? You sat right here. We want to know what's, what we really want to know is this you in Oreo's abortion or was the comments lying? Yeah. Is my mouth down? No, your mouth is <laughs> down. It's right here. Okay. Hello. No, it's not. It's not a phone call. It's on. Live. I know it is on live. My bad. Hey. Hey. What's going on? We want to know what's up. What's up? So you know, it's just we just was watching the premiere, the YouTube videos, and mm-hmm. all of that. And y'all had to sit down in person, mm-hmm. and you said that she was using God as an excuse. And I still you know, do feel that way. Huh? And I still do feel that way. Ooh. <laughs> he tripping. Oh, lordy, lordy. <laughs> but like, you, oh. you a woman of God, right? Right, right. And some people don't have to post God on Instagram twenty four seven to prove that. But I, I being like, I'm in my Bible off screen yeah. too. Mm-hmm. Facts. No, she didn't. No, Nadia. <laughs> like, no, if you're a woman of God, you don't. No, you didn't. Like, I'm not judging you, but it's just like, that's crazy. Nadia. <laughs> no, uh, come on. You serious? You serious? I, <laughs> I, you know me. I'm, you know, I believe in, I believe in Lucy, so I don't know all that. But I'm just saying, I don't think that's going to look good on the surface when you said something like that. This is a holy Christian woman. Right. If, if she, you know, if she want to post God in her sleep, 
in mm -hmm. her while she's on the toilet in right. the shower while she's reading a book while she's cooking dinner while mm -hmm. she's eating anything she i honestly don't think that she could right of course not that's not what i'm saying i'm just saying some people feel like they try to use that god shit like I don't know. I don't really want to get into that. But at the end of the day, not everybody has to post God 24 7 for them to know God. But I'm in my Bible in real life, though. Okay. okay. <laughs> never said you wasn't. Facts. Oh, okay, then. So, what you trying oh, okay. to. I'm using okay. God as an excuse, but oh, okay. I'm getting closer to God. Okay. I'm on my journey. So, what mm -hmm. you trying to say? Right. Or you really don't want me to clock anything for us. So uh, really go ahead. Me. Like, anything that I you really got to say, like, go ahead. Me. Like. So, you, so, Nadia, what you trying to say? She's not holy? I'm just saying, like, I'm confused on how. Did you try to say you're not holy? And, and that's just like, and that's cool, and that's her opinion. But it's just like, I deal with stuff within, and I said, I don't want to deal with that no more, so. Mm -hmm. She's trying to say you're not holy. Oh my God. Nah, it's not even that. It's just the fact of the way you're trying to put out on, on the internet is that you 100% for God. But it's like, how the hell is I you didn't say I'm. What are you okay, talking so, about? I just so started you, my journey. You act like right. I'm, I'm a whole Christian. Like, right. what? Right. Right. I'm just, I literally just started my like journey. The internet is like you do no wrong, and it's God this, God that on everything you do. That right? day, you I literally pointed friend. out my flaws. Okay, what are you are talking you about? <laughs> I literally done? said I have a lusting spirit. I literally like. Right. What are you talking about? Right. Okay. Cool. Exactly. Uh, That's me pointing you know, out my flaws and taking accountability. Right. Yeah. Are you done? For sure. For sure. Okay. Cool. So like, like I was saying. I'm confused on how you use God for every any and everything that you do. But you sat in my face and you said that you and your friend both did shit in the past and y'all mm -hmm. both trying to build with each other to get over it. Did you not say that? Yeah. Right, cool. Yeah, friends lift each other up, cool. But at the end of the day, if you're really as godly as you say you are, why the hell is you and that same friend going against the grain doing the same shit that y'all trying to get away from? How but I'm not doing I'm not doing that. Please tell me. Please lie. I'm I'm not doing that. Like like I said, what was y'all doing? I, I was, struggle with, what was I struggle doing? with temptations. I struggle with temptations right. every day. It's right. you gonna fall and you're gonna get right back up. What are right. you talking about? Right. You, I'm literally at the beginning of my journey. Everything mm -hmm. not gonna be what what you trying to say they was three or four? <laughs> I'm not I'm not even not like that's not again, that's not my business to tell, but I'm just saying you don't sit. And you don't you try, try to say y'all was tricky God on the internet. Like I don't, I don't know what you trying to say. Like I was tricky. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I like I be having sex. So I'm trying to figure. So what was it that y'all wasn't doing? Because whatever it was, it wasn't holy. So I'm trying to figure it out. Because if she's saying it and she making it into mm -hmm. an issue, something wasn't right. It was unhinged. So I'm trying to figure out. It's what not was even it about. It's not even about what they did. It's just the fact of don't get on the internet saying that motherfuckers were stopping you from getting close to God when you still doing the shit that you was doing when you was with me. But with I'm not people. doing the same thing I you was doing. Though. What are you, you are talking though. about? You are though. I'm not gonna like, lie I'm you not though. though. You're not, you you're not here. Like, you what are you though. talking about? You are you're not here. Now, now, Nadia, can I ask you a question? Mm -hmm. Did I ask you, are you Christian as well? I am. So as you being a Christian woman, and this is all me just asking with respect, as you being a Christian woman, mm. Who are you to judge another Christian woman? Okay. Right. Facts. And that's nothing that I'm trying to say. It's not, not me you. judging her. It's just <laughs> <you're saying laughs> what you you sitting here you and you're about? trying to put it on somebody. Oh, well, I'm godly and I'm this and I'm that. So I don't want to be a da da da. But you're doing the same shit. Like, don't sit and try to contradict yourself saying you're doing all this other shit. But Look who talking. You're being a hypocrite. I ain't going to lie. Look you who talking. Who? Have I gone on the talking. internet and said, oh, I'm going to Look who I'm, talking. I'm Okay. Look, literally, right. like Nadia, right. look who's talking right. right now. Right, Nadia, look who's talking right now. Look who's talking. Mm -hmm. Look who's talking. Are you gonna like elaborate? Look, who, that? look, look, look who's say? talking. Okay, that's all you gonna say. Cool. Look who's talking. Cause who you talking? like it's who's not it's not me? sinking in with you. Look who's talking. Oh. Uh, can look you explain a little bit more if you like, like, please? Because I'm confused. Look, look who's talking. <laughs> well, I think we I'm all confused. Are. <laughs> like, oh, okay. Because if that's all I said, talking. that was nothing. Let, let it sink in. <laughs> like, mm -hmm. some people, some people it, actually not want yet, to. It does me. not sound like you are holy either. That's what it sounds like. Right. Now, I'm not understanding how y'all went from being BFFs to being Jehovah Witness. <laughs> Cause right now y'all acting like y'all Jehovah Witnesses. I, I like you know, I, I'm not even judging her because I literally just said like I went through the same shit, mm -hmm. and I just I just want to change. 
Lord, I can't. This is too much. I need to. <sighs> and I just want to change. And God said, um, he going to bring you as you are. If you messed up and all that, mm -hmm. he don't care. He don't care. So, like, what are you judging for? Come on now. And I'm judging? Now, Nadia, did you mention something about the girl abortion or was the comments just lying? Because they said Ooh. that you mentioned. No. Who? They said that you mentioned something about Oreo's abortion. Nah. Okay. So this was said because Ori got on the internet and she was like, again, the sad ass shit. And that was really blowing me because she got on the internet oh, no, you saying didn't. some shit like, oh, she hang around people that hurt her and it's just hurting my feelings because I would never Cause do Because I want what's best for you. So you talk about my right. abortion? Right. <laughs> cool. So that's when I got in front of a camera. Something's wrong with said, this girl, bro. Okay, are you are you done? Like you slow or something, bro. Are you done being sad and just sad as you slow, are you, bro? Are you done? <laughs> oh, okay. okay you so I got on. Bitch. Are you done? Like, bro, you slow, bro. You didn't say nothing about the Like, I'm so confused. Are you done? Like. No, we're just like, getting started. Did you say what like, you said? Like, okay, anyway, because, again, this is sad-ass victimizing shit that she keep doing. Because, again, I didn't bring up her abortion. She said that her feelings was hurt because I, quote-unquote, was hanging around people who hurt me. So I said, it was, you your feelings wasn't hurt when you was going to go and rekindle with a girl that got on live and said something about your abortion. Did Were you or were you not going to do that? Um, yes, I was going to sit down, but I didn't, though. Right, but you definitely were. And why were you? Because you knew it was going to bring money in. But but I didn't, though. Right, but were you? But I didn't, though. But did you text her? But then I realized that I got morals. Well, I had morals, oh, and I didn't. I was like, you know what? I don't even care about that cloud shit. I'm going to find something else to do. Right, so is that what stopped exactly. you, or was it so, But I didn't, though. It was it was a thought in my mind, for right. sure, rekindling. But mm -hmm. then I realized, damn, she really did go on the internet. She really did. You know, right. right. And so I is that myself, really what you know, I had to take a step time? back, you know? Right, and right. Had to think. So is that like, really what yeah, stopped you, or was it because we peeped her and Arion was Lincoln, and that's really why you didn't want to go? Um, like, because you no. had morals. I mean, shit, like shit. She wanted to link with Arion. Go ahead. Like. Right, and that's why you didn't go and do the sit down with her. But you pointed out, you said, "Oh, I think she's gonna do a sit down." I was like, "Okay." I mean, uh, well, wait, like, when y'all all rock the same boat, cause Nadia, I'm confused. But it's just like she got like all this like built up, and I, like Hold her up. like bringing all this out is like kind of like it's like it's interesting. Wait, you know Nadia, saying? when y'all all have rock rope roll the same boat then i'm confused that's Didn't what kids? i'm saying that's why and that's exactly why i'm getting on here and saying that because it's the fact of don't sit in front of a camera acting like niggas is just doing shit and it's hurting you when you was doing the same shit because you're being no, a no, 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 and no, no, that's no, why no, i said no, no. we're missing the bigger picture nadia you were the same i'm and this is just me being real you i'm confused kim did the same exact thing that tati did the oreo Right, that's what you, I'm saying. If you, we both Cam did the, but Cam did worse to you, and you right. happened to collab. And okay, I feel like, but, but I didn't. Going over but I, did. I feel like it's going over your head. I'm saying okay, explain, you explain saying you more. hurt by you saying you're being hurt <laughs> by me doing something, but you're doing the same shit. But I did, but I didn't do it though. Oh my god. Okay. So you're so Nadia. What you're saying is that she's supposed to be a changed woman, but she's backpedaling to people that hurt but, her. But that was way before I even wrong. thought about that. that but that was way head. before I even thought about getting back. Right? right? What are you talking about? That was. Okay. All right, girl. Whatever. So, <laughs> wait, so Nadia, is that the point that you? Oh, wait. But Oreo, you're saying that that was way before though. That like that whole like me getting rekindled with Tati. That was last year. That was like oh, what? Okay. That was like December. Nadia, is that like, true? I get, yeah, you're right. Oh. Exactly. So what did you bring in something that old up for? Mm -hmm. Right. But you actually rekindled with somebody that actually hurt you and that hurt me. So like. How does that work? Okay. So who was the person that she rekindled with that hurted you so bad? Or no, it was just like, no, it was just like to the point, like we, we all had a talk and y'all, us three, we all had a talk and it was like, we don't. We don't really too much. Y'all don't need influencer city. Like y'all don't. Like, and I was like, Nadia, like you are influencer city, bro. Like, if anything, like, come on now, you flourish more, like more, more than him. Like you can turn something negative into something positive. Like I was, we all had a talk, and we were surrounded by people that we looked up to, and we took that as a sign. So it was like, damn. When I went back home, and when I seen y'all go back around the you're saying it's Buddha. 
It was like business wise, and I was like, okay, cool. And then not a part not, of the not the Wooda situation. I don't really. Do yeah, no, no. I was about to like, say. Wooda's I kind of. I don't. I don't care about that. But I was like, damn. Like, no. When I seen y'all fighting together, I was like, damn, y'all that like y'all got back close like that. Like y'all back cool like that. So that's why I was like, like I was like confused. Like from what I'm seeing, I'm confused. Oh, Vinay and them. Like I'm confused. That's why I said influencer shitty. Like that's why I was like she she don't need influencer. Okay, so yeah, so let's let's put that on the floor. So maybe she are you talking about the way that they just was like while Cam was just like threatening to get Benet to beat up Nadia and he was calling her all types of B words out in the parking lot and stuff like that. Okay, so cool. Maybe okay, can I just explain how I see it? Y'all were almost forming your own group. You key Eli Ida and Oreo. So mm -hmm. it seems as though that, ju that group had dropped and you went back over to Influence the City. And then it's just like you fought for the, the people that were about to fight you. Oreo, am I somewhat right in that way? Okay. So it, it that's maybe where she's coming from because Cam did say, I'll get Benet to beat her butt and this, that, and the third. And, you know, the next night you ended up fighting. Well, I'm not, not literally, but you know what I'm saying? Like the next... You know, Tom, you've seen them, you ended up fighting for them. So it's like maybe she's hurt in the situation right. that you were able to forgive people that were literally willing to hurt you. Mm -hmm. and, and then, like, I was just always there to be in defense. And that one time that I wasn't there, like. And okay, so this is where it could come from with Oreo. It's like, if you, def and, and this is exactly why sometimes it's best to mind your business, because it comes off like this. Let's just say me and you were best friends, Oreo, and mm -hmm. you and Nadia keeps having, you know, situations and y'all fall out every other day. And I somewhat be like, okay, let me defend Oreo. <clears throat> I defend you the first time. Now you and Nadia back cool. Then it's like, okay, y'all fall out again. I defend you the second time. Now y'all back cool again. Now it's like the third time, should I jump in or should I mind my business? Because yeah. now it's going to make it awkward with me and them because the only thing you're going to do is be right back cool with them. So it's like Nadia maybe is like, you know, that's where y'all, y'all keep saying her name is not Oreo. Um, I call her Oreo. So <laughs> what about it? Okay. I call her Oreo. It's not Ori. I call her Oreo. Okay. So Nadia, that's maybe where Oreo's coming from in this situation, but Nadia is coming from and Oreo. This is what I'm gonna say. Nadia is coming from mm -hmm. it like this: If you're willing to surround yourself with individuals that hurt you, you should not be trying to give her the same advice because mm -hmm. you were willing to do it once before. And let me also say this: I'm gonna be honest. Mm -hmm. When you're saved, not everybody else will be saved. When you're saved, if that makes sense. So mm -hmm. when you're looking for when you're looking for it to be saved. Not everybody's in that same time frame and mentality that you are in. Because, mm -hmm. for example, you may be moving on to the better things. I may have not been able to see the big, better, better things yet, but as you being a friend, teach me. Teach me those better things. Show me that it's okay to see the better things. That's just how I feel about it. And as mm -hmm. you and Nadia being sisters, twins, or whatever it is, you know, one thing I love is mess, but one thing I can admire is realness. Y'all mm -hmm. could have y'all could have definitely went past this and definitely really outgrew this situation. But once business start being splattered on social media and it's being coded, may not be full blown blast, but being coded, all friendships is over with. Because it's things that I know about Oreo and Oreo knows about me. Nadia, is this things that you may know about me and it's things that I may know about you. But we will have our little small arguments in the air. But, you know, once the serious things start being hidden on the surface, it's nothing else that we can really talk about. It's all best loose with that one. So I don't know what y'all been putting out of each other, but, you know. Just yeah, fine. I never, like, bash her or anything like that, but, you know. Yeah, I can say that. I haven't seen anything that's been, you know, back on the desk. Nadia, have you got anything you wanted to say? Mm-mm. You sound over it, Nadia. I am. So you don't see yourself being s friends with Oreo again? That's cool. I mean, we we already had this conversation for for. It's like Lukey, like it's. But so what what re brought it back up though? Like I said, um, 
it's just a whole lot of sad shit that's just like I don't like when people try to fake be sad. I hate that. I hate that shit. Like don't don't get on the internet crying when you know you weren't just as good. Like that that's the only thing I'm trying to comment. But that's why I took accountability for, but I wasn't really too much sad. I was literally talking about like how insecure I was. I was talking about like lusting, like I was talking about I was talking about shit that I was doing. So how was that like me being sad? It just gave real like puppy dog for for but I mean, shit, I mean, it, ain't, it ain't, it's, like, we gonna be on here for hours talking about this shit. Yeah. I, I already she said what I song. said. I feel like I told mm. my side of the story, and at the end of the day, it's, it's dead for a for long Can we leave with some form of maturity, though? Can we at least, you know, attempt to give each other an apology? Like, can y'all just open your hearts up for one minute? Just one I mean, minute. I just feel as though, honestly, like... Honestly, for real, for real, I feel like the only thing I can really apologize is with the TikTok. It seems shady from the outside looking in, plus the comments. So it's like, I kind of understand if that probably got to your head. But at the end of the day, if we was really friends, that should have never been a uh, first thought. Because, I mean, again, you didn't even like the picture. That's the only picture me, Kia, and Ida have. You wasn't the only person I was cropped out. We all, both, all three of us just got done fighting. So I feel like that should have just been common sense to you. And you just let the comments, you know, boost your head just a little bit. But, I mean, if it looked, you know, shady, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm going to apologize. But, I mean, again, but like, it, like it kind of like, like, but we already had this talk. We said... Yeah, it that's was right. actually, and then the, the text messages really that you sent me. So it was kind of like me. you said yeah. in my in a in message that you sent me that I'm pushing my real friend friends friends away. And then mm -hmm. in your TikTok caption, you said three out of three the ones that never pushed me away. So right. um, you know, mm -hmm. you would think you would think like if world put yourself in my shoes, you would think the same mm -hmm. type B, you know. And if we supposed to be three out of three. The main three, you know what I'm saying? But you, you showed me that you was told no me. main three because I mean, but if you we told are me. hanging around, I mean, I feel like that's another reason why shit just didn't work out because I just feel as though you wanted to be held to a hundred higher standard when no, it I came. Didn't, though, but when like, it came in, nah, you did though because you just said it, main three. So as I just felt like you wanted to be top three when it came to other people, and that's why all that other weird shit that was, yeah. But I mean, again, I'm gonna that apologize if you thought it was shady. I mean, or you just said main three, like it. It, it don't make sense. Like, okay, if me, okay. you, and Key literally just said, and I said it to her. I said it was always supposed to be, even if shit was to go, if shit was to go down, it was always gonna be us three. So I was oh. like, okay, cool. So when I looked at three out of three, because that's how, like, I would say that's how it started. Right, so I was like, how many oh damn, fought, how many people? Fought? I got it was three of us. So it's like. It's not giving a replacement. If it was three of us fighting, but that's how it looks. Like, but you're like you're trying to invalidate my my, my feelings. No. <laughs> you're trying to invalidate it. Not like, even that. I just understand, you what, you're, I understand what you're saying. Like, you posted you're three out of three because y'all fought together. Cool. But from the out, like from me, like if wait. I'm so gonna, who's the three? So who's the three out of three now? You what, key? It, it is no three. No, 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 no. But I'm wasn't that saying, in the TikTok video though? If it was three, I'm saying, if it's if it was three of us fighting, why would you take that as either replacing you when all we did was just fight together? But there was no context behind the TikTok. Like you never said anything about oh three out of three. Oh, these right. they just fought for me. You said so three out of three. The ones so they never pushed me around. away. So and that's literally what you text TikTok. me. I pushed you away. Right. So we wasn't all around TikTok, Instagram, and YouTube after we three just fought together. I'm confused. What do you mean it's no context? No, I'm not like, going to speak. I'm not going to be honest in this situation. I don't want nobody to feel like I'm being biased. Y'all know I'm, I'm going to be real, but I don't want nobody to feel like I'm being biased. So I'm going to just listen. Child, at this point. <laughs> you know, let me... <laughs> Hold on, let me get a piece of paper and a pencil real quick, just so they they can try, they can sign the um, terms and agreements. Can can, can would y'all mind signing the terms and agreements real quick before I just say what I'm gonna say real quick? Because I just feel like somebody has to be real. Can I? Would Nadia? Can would you mind signing? Just tell me that you give me approval. Yeah, go ahead. Oreo. I'm charging shit to the game for sure, but go ahead. Um, thank you so much, Nadia. Let me be real, baby. I feel like this new Nadia ain't it. This old Nadia may be, because I personally feel like you used Oreo 
when you needed her at, during your moment. But now that you don't need her no more, you excluded her from out the picture. Now it's just like, okay, let me just act like I'm the shit. When honestly, in all actuality, y'all was the big three. Yuki mm -hmm. and Oreo was definitely the big three. Y'all mm -hmm. was just holding hands, skipping down the yellow brick road when Wuda was all up in Oreo face and you was defending her every chance you can get. Y'all mm -hmm. was sleeping at each other house, making s'mores, eating Pop-Tarts, laying on each other couches. Now y'all acting like y'all just not the sister wives and best friends and just that in the third. Y'all was just doing the content with your brother at your crib. You invited her all the way to your house in Dallas. I'm confused on when this friendship just got thrown out the window like this. Now also, let me be real. Ida, you know, she just came into the picture when I just seen this friendship, but let's keep it a buck. The same girl that you saying that's just your friend and she just was the part of the three, that's cool said and done. But where was the same energy at when them girls was ganging up on you on that couch in that Influence the City reunion? Because I'm pretty sure if Oreo was there, she would have said it. I would have been on team about five, you. Five, six, seven. About? It could have just been a one-on-one. -on -one. I'm just not understanding. Like always, I, I'm just confused. Always. And also, I'm going to keep it a buck. I don't give a fuck who says what. I'm going to keep it real. I don't care. Y'all are the same ones that include Ida to everything. I don't want to be included in everything. <laughs> Let's keep it a buck. We're not going to keep doing this. Wherever the numbers is at, Ida's right behind them. Oreo's been there from the very beginning where the numbers was low, high, medium, medium. We don't care about the numbers over here, Pookie Butt. So I'm confused on why does it just always get... It's like the realest motherfuckers that y'all have on y'all team. Y'all just dismiss them. Right. Key's so been there. I see the difference with you and Key. Y'all, you know, Key's been out the picture, in the picture, mm -hmm. out the picture, in the picture. But it's just like, that's why I mess with Key because Key knows her boundaries and Key's always going to be there no matter what. Key mm -hmm. could take a break. She could step back. But Key going to know her place and she going to step up. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to ask like, you this. What, what do you mean, uh when I needed Ori and then when I was done. Cause like, no shade, like I'm not even saying this, none of that, but it's like, what have motherfuckers ever did for me that, you know what I'm saying? Like what was done? Like, what do you mean? What was there to be used? Oreo was there when they was all bashing you, baby. And I was there for Oreo emotional the support with everything, everything like. <laughs> Oreo was the only right. one that was backing your Even if it's like, okay, so like, fuck money aside, fuck views aside, fuck I money aside. I was about. there, I was actually your friend though. Like. Mm -hmm. Dead ass, fuck money, fuck views, all that. Mm -hmm. I was your friend for real life situations. Dead okay. ass. So when you did that you? end and when did I cut that off and push you to the curve? When you cropped that picture out and you posted it on TikTok. After the three people that was on the TikTok fought. But don't you think that's a little low blow though? I really don't think so. I really Nadia, don't that's, that's think low key a low blow. All right. One person fighting for you in one situation does not detain the friendship that does not hold up. I'm making up words and shit does not admire the friendship that you have with Oreo. Right. Like y'all said, y'all both been there for each other. It does not. It One fight should not determine a friendship that you have with one person to exclude them from anything. Now, if you wanted to add Ori, I mean, Ida, Ida to the picture, you could have definitely added her and it could have been a big the big four, but to just cut Oreo out as if she wasn't a part of the big three to begin with, it's just like, like, I don't know. That's just kind of like having me a scratch on the head right there. Like, I'm not understanding it. Right. Who fought for me one time? Is you talking about Key? I mean, Key fought for you and Ida did too, right? Yeah. So what do you, what do you mean by that? What Wait, Oreo, you? wasn't you fighting too when y'all was all in uh Florida? Right. Yeah. And okay, then, like, so was, I was getting into, like, with the whole friend thing. Like, I ain't had to put my input put with her. But Nadia, did you, did you, did, did she? You did didn't it? put your input with friend. You know I that. Was, you I was arguing with friend on the internet. What Why? You talking because about? she said something to you first. You didn't say nothing. Did you or did you not? Ben said that. No, I'm saying. Like, what the fuck? No, don't. But I'm don't, saying, don't though, like, I was, when you was getting into it with people, I was getting into it with people, too. You was not arguing for me. You didn't say but, shit when me and Fran was arguing. Fran said something to you first. So That's I, when you started popping it. You wasn't doing that out of respect for me. Don't don't even get on here saying that. Because you was just on live crying about that. You did not say shit to Fran. Wait, Fran crying about that? Hold, hold up. Hold don't, up. Hold don't up. Even, hold up. Don't even. But like, don't when, when was there a time like where you like what the fuck is you talking about? defended me? Shit go both ways. What are you talking about? There's a difference between fighting for someone mentally and physically. Oreo was fighting for you mentally through a lot of situations from what I'm hearing of. But right. you're only counting the physical things because it seems like to me, only reason why Ida even fought 
in Florida was because she got swung on. Now I'm trying to figure out on what does the difference between Ida and Oreo has on Oreo jumping in a fight on the internet, on words and he say, she say bullshit compared to you only stepping into a fight because Ida got swung on. It wasn't the other way around. Like you got swung on and Ida jumped in. Right. When we it's was like in Orlando, the same way. When we was in Orlando, that was damn near out of fight. I wasn't fighting for her. So when did Ida fight for you? When we was in Influenza City House. Oh, that was <laughs> that's the fight that y'all considered that she fought for you because it just seemed like y'all just wanted the girls to get. I thought that was just a, a free for all. I didn't think that was a personal fight. I thought y'all was talking about the one in Florida. I didn't think. Hold on, wait. You mean to tell me wait, that's the fight that you considered? On, huh? Listen to what I'm saying. That's the fight that you considered her fighting for you? Who? Wait, hold on, pause. You said Ida only fought because she got swung on? I'm thinking y'all talking about the one in Florida. Right. That was Ida fight, though. Yeah, we so when you said she fought, Ida. that was the only thing that I can imagine y'all actually fighting together. The other one was a right. free for all. And then when we was in, in the Influencer City House and we was all upstairs and the girl walked out the bathroom and I was trying to explain to her that, you know, all that cool. And then she started popping out the mouth. Ida was right there defending me. She swung. She was defending me. Over y'all did too. Okay, then. So what the fuck? Why is y'all trying to sit and compare then? If, no, they, if they both doing the same you, you, shit. You compared the friendship and you cropped her out because you felt like Ida was there in oh, a fight for you. How That's is that comparing, Maj? I feel like, no, nah, hell no. Nah. How is that comparing a friendship if me, Ida, and Key, not Ori, fought? How is that shady if it's just us three fighting? Listen now, to what if you Ori just, was there, okay, cool. Listen to what you but just I said. Made, I made appreciation posts about Ori multiple times. When she did what she had to do. Or when we all doing fucking road trips, did I not post y'all? Yes, it's been appreciation post. How the fuck is that being shady if I want to appreciate the two people that fought for me that night? How because is that shady? Cause you because already Ori and Eli was cropped out? Was the separation not already like stamped with y'all two? Who? With you and Oreo during that time. We was already being separated, yeah. So you wouldn't think that on the back and she would take that as some form of a shade? But why is that your first mind? That that's shady? Because y'all fell out. Y'all not cool no more. No, we didn't fall out at that time. <clears throat> but I just right? I literally just chat, told, like, it goes from the, the context of the TikTok and the message the text message. Right. So that's what made but me think that the post was about me. Okay. That's why I didn't go I that's why I didn't text you about the TikTok. All right. I text you about All they right. said that you was on live and you said um, I don't answer the phone. And that's when I text you, I said, Now do you say I don't answer the phone? Shit, I, I just said I just text yeah. you and you know what I'm saying? Like, like, it's just like blueberry for sure. Like, I like it. It's still my favorite Gatorade since. But, well, you know what I'm saying? Like, That's why I was like, I, I text you. Like, I didn't go I off, I didn't like go off and base the TikTok. And you even said, you never text me about the TikTok. You never text me about the TikTok. Because I didn't. I text you about what you said on live. Under the comments of the TikTok, you said I didn't answer the phone. And you said, I pushed you away. And... That and that's what said in the caption on the TikTok. And that's when I was like, oh, then that post is about me then. Oh, God, I, I ain't seen great on here. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if you like getting what I'm, I don't know if you putting up what I'm putting down. Mm -hmm. You like the cucumber? Mm-hmm. That, that bitch must. Bro, and it's, it's, it's like, I don't want to give bias in this situation, but I'm just giving real. And from, oh, and, 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 and let's just keep it a buck. I was there when y'all formed this friendship when y'all were honestly like the best of friends, it all started when we was all up in that room and y'all literally was rocking for each other. So I'm just confused on just like the situation. It's it's just a lot. I, I just hate to see a friendship that I thought that was really, really true and real and just go down the drain, honestly. I really hate to see that. And, I mean, and, it's, it is. and can I, it's just like, you know, Nadia, can I ask you a question? Why do you hang out with those people that treat you so horrible? Okay, so at the end of the day, Influencer City does not treat me bad at all. 
like at all do we sit and do we argue yeah but i mean shit like that happened now so far as camp because cam did hit a couple low blows and i did too but it's like saying that they doing all this hurting me and da 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 and uh, especially when you trying to refer to the shit that happened at ida's party we both had two different perspectives so it's like and at the end of the day if we all work together then it's like what the fuck is the point in sitting here having walking around the same house with animosity so it's like mm -hmm. I mean, me personally, I really don't feel the need to have no beef or no tension towards nobody. Yeah, I feel you. But, I, I mean, that's just me, though. That's just me. I mean, if motherfuckers want to, I mean, shit, that's me. Yeah, no, I, I know, I know when um she uh, child, listen, I know when um Nadia, I only have my only advice to you is just to learn your worth, man. Not everybody's with you. Not everybody's for you, and you know, and that's like, already overstood. That's what because it's like when I first started being around them, and I said this in my video my first time being around them, you know, I was I was looking for like friends and da da da, like tight, like I just not hear y'all, but then it's like when certain shit kept playing out, and I'm starting to realize who who really there and who really not, then it's like, okay, now I'm, I'm going in with my eyes open. It's like we cool, we cordial, but it's not like type shit, like we not friends, like we just co-workers at its best and that's totally fine because again we all work with each other do we got to be friends tight like a booty hole no but is there any like there's no reason to sit and be beefed up with nobody especially if we work with each other so i understand what you're saying learn your worth da, 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 da. but i mean i lived and i learned and now i just know who who i can be tight with and who i can't so it ain't even it ain't even on that type of tip for real for real yeah you you still young so you got a lot of worth i mean a lot of learning to uh do nadia you know nobody's here to judge you but you know to make fun about somebody's miscarriage is outrageous especially because that was you know that was your blood at one point and things like that so i just personally feel as though like it, it just goes to show like if somebody's hey, willing what are you to talking that, about can't make oh, fun of your miscarriage. Oh, 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 yeah oh, oh. so if if somebody can go that low with you it's mm -hmm. just like damn but it's just like, you know, it, it, to even allow people to go that low with you and you're supposed to be friends with them, mm. it, it's, yeah, that's just how I feel. Um, mm. Now, truth being told, it's like, yeah, you said something about y'all ain't got to be as tight as a booty or whatever it is, cool. Now, I, why does that image keep getting put out there, though? What? Like, y'all just, y'all just like this, but behind closed doors, if y'all do fall out, your miscarriage is being brought up and... This, that, and the th like, I'm just a little confused. I know what you're Wait, so what are you trying to say? Like, what are you asking? Why sit with why sit with fake love when you can sit with real love? Is real love weirdo? Like, what what do you mean? Real love like Oreo. Mm. Why sit with real why sit with fake love when you can sit with real love? Like, okay, for example, where where am I love? sitting? Like you saying like I'm going back to influence the city. Kumbaya, I, I didn't say that. Like, that was Oreo words. Right. So, but you asking why am I sitting and doing all this, loving them again and doing all this shit with them again and I'm not doing with Ori, right? I mean, basically, yeah. I mean, it's just some shit like, okay, so it's like, that's like you, okay. So let's say you being around somebody and it's like, yeah, like we not tight like a booty hole. So it's like, your expectations for that person not as high. So it's like, you kind of expect them to sit and fuck up and da da da. Cause at the end of the day, we not friends. We not, we not doing what me and Ori doing. Y'all not staying at my house. Y'all not knowing me on a higher than a surface level. So it's like, expectations are already low. Like you don't owe me shit. Cause at the end of the day, we're just coworkers. Versus when it's someone like Ori, who's doing all this shit, she's at my house and we vented to each other and we know each other on a, like above surface level. Then it's like, when you start doing shit, it's like, yeah, you just held to a higher standard because at the end of the day, we were friends versus associates and a coworker. And it's like, that's two different things. Cause it's like, are right, you doing shit? But at the end of the day, it's not tolerated, but I mean, you just a associate. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah. I mean, by all means, I do understand the part when you say like, we're not friends. We just have to work with each other for the money and things like that. So that I totally understand. Um, so I don't know, but that just seemed like where your friend is hurt at, aka Oreo. It seemed like she just don't like the fact that you're keep you keep allowing people that hurt you back into your life. Right. And, 
Okay. A real friend, uh, and let me also say this, a, a real friend will express to you that's how they feel, mm -hmm. and if that bothers them, I think sometimes you should honestly just sit your real friend down like, hey, I understand that that bothers you, but this is where I'm coming from. I understand da 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 And if y'all can't see okay, eye to so eye about cool. it, it's time to depart ways. All right, so this is when I referred, but I'm just going to name drop because I think you already know what I'm talking about. But this was back. Okay, so you're basically saying like, okay, me going back to the same people that hurt me just to work, that's understandable, but it's like, or you were going to sit and have a sit down with a female that brought up y'all personal business on live. Like y'all both went back and forth on oh, live and you still okay. was going to do a sit down for the business, for the money. And you said that. And what did I tell you? I sat in your face and I told you now don't be her friend. But if y'all want to sit and keep it business and get the money together, that's totally understandable. But going back to trusting them and being as tight, I really don't think that's best for you. But when it's me, you want to sit and act like, oh, I'm just hurting you and da-da-da-da. But when the shoes was flipped, I handled it more on a mature level. I tried to get where you was coming from. I never bashed you for trying to do what you wanted to do. I never got on the internet and say you hurting me for wanting to go back to an old friend. That's what all I was trying to say. Never brought up an abortion. I just wanted you to realize all this shit that you're trying to point out and say that you so hurt about me doing, you was in the same predicament. Whether you sat down in front of a camera or not, it was still in the back of your mind because you understood business is business money is money but being tight again will never happen because you cross certain lines and that's just that mm. that's that's all i'm trying to get at now, that just, part that part i can see i can see i can see where you're coming from with that i can see where you're coming from with that that mm -hmm. part i could totally understand where you're coming from with that but i think her point is that she didn't link up with them that's the thing that that's the big difference right and I okay totally so that. okay you, i get what you're saying but like, like i said day, like i you didn't knew why you was it, it was move. a thought but then i realized like damn like i'm not finna you know i'm not finna double back on that and i didn't so it's just like you're kind of doing what you told me not to do who i so i told you not to link with the girl like you're like what you no, just answer the question. It's cool though, but like I told you not to link with her. Or did I tell you you can go when you can go? No, like be about I'm your business and get your money. Just, oh, okay, oh, okay. Don't get on here lying now. Don't Child, you're not getting what I'm saying. Like, okay, so like, what do you mean though? So like, I didn't, I didn't do it, and it was a thought, and then it was a thought, and then when I process, like I process, and I'm like, okay. Matter of fact, no, I'm not finna do it. Boom. Mm. And I told you, I was like, I don't think, I even said, you don't need them. I'm encouraging you. You don't okay, need not, them. Okay, not That's what I keep that. telling you. You we don't need them. That's all I'm telling you. You don't need them. You're her. Mm. Like, what the fuck? Like, you're Nadia J. Like, you can make all this shit pop off. And okay, then, we like, referring back to your situation, though. Like, you keep but trying to speak. Though, keep trying this, to this is before, me. this is before anything. This is old. Like, this okay. is like, this is old, though. Mm -hmm. Like, I get what you're saying, but I, but I didn't do it, though. Right. Yeah, I was like, damn, Nadia, you think I should? He was like, I mean, it's good business wise. Da, 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 da. I was like, yeah, you right. Cool. Mm -hmm. I see some. And then what happened? Hold on, hold on, I see hold on. somebody he like. Cool. Right. And I was like, matter of fact, no. Nah. Don't do it. Right. Okay. I was like, matter of fact, no. Nah. And that's what made me, I didn't do it. So right. Like, because not because you learned your morals. Thank you for clearing that up. Because earlier you said because you learned your morals and da 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 da. No. It's because you seen that she was back, double backing with your ex after she was just going to do business with you. And he was like, nah, that was your clarification to not do it. With her. Exactly. You and know, I didn't house. do And I was like, but the right. thing is, I was cool. already But she was just going to do the same shit. I was, that's the, that's I the moral of the story. But I was overthinking. I'm like, damn, should I do it or not, though? Like, mm. I'm already in that right there when she went back, I was like, all right, cool. That's that that's was the clear because you're right there. So yes. that's but I didn't yes. do it though. Yeah, yes. it was in my mind, and I asked you for advice for it, and you gave me advice. Cool. Right. Exactly. Yes. It was. I was like, okay, cool, and I took. You know. But don't try and don't try and don't try and do all this other shit about trying to put me out like you hurt when you was just gonna do the same shit, whether you did it or not. You was in the same headspace. Yo, it's just the fact of mm -hmm. she did something you didn't like, so that was your clarification. Nobody ever did some when I'm in the midst of thinking of going back. Nobody ever did something that made me want to fall back. That was the only difference. But again, don't try to knock me for doing something but if like, you was in I the same place not know. that long ago. I don't know. I feel like I don't that's know. just me though. Shit, let me know if I'm wrong, Mark. I, I, I'm gonna be honest. I get, I get where you're coming from in that situation. I totally do. 
But it's just like actions does speak louder than words. And in that situation, it's not like she actually did link up with them, but she definitely did have the same mindset that you had when you came to linking up with them. So in that situation, she didn't do it, but she still did have that type of mind. Mm -hmm. um, and I would never like, yeah, I had that type of mind and I was like, all right, cool. And mm -hmm. I didn't do it though. I'm not going to say I didn't like have the thought because I did. I was like, all right, I'm going to have a sit down, talk with the girl. Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. And then that shit popped up. And I was like, you know what? Fuck that shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, now, somebody right. just said. But if somebody... she was never caught with Arion, you would have did it. Maybe not. I don't know. Oh, okay. Nah. Mm. Now, but, I, but it I... didn't happen, though. So, like. I, right. Me honestly, I think it's just certain limits to certain things in life, mm -hmm. and it like. Don't get me wrong, making fun of somebody abortion is one thing, but when you're trolling somebody's miscarriage, is another, mm -hmm. and that just goes to show. Like I, I don't know what's worse, but I think the miscarriage is worse, especially for the same person that be like, I'm gonna get somebody to slap the shit out you. Oh, I'm gonna get my, I'm gonna get my sister to beat you up. I'm gonna. It's like to me, once you talk about wanting to put your hands on me, we can never go back and we can never be friends. Because every time I see you, I'm gonna either get my sister to beat you up or I'm gonna end up beating your brother up every time I see him. It's never gonna be no. You feel me? Like I don't really, I don't really get that because I'll never trust you. Like it's not about to give. Oh, right. Y and that's the whole point, though. You're not supposed to go back and rekindling or whatever the fuck. You're not supposed to go back trusting. It's just like, okay, I see how you move, and I'm just gonna keep you at an arm's length. But at the end of the day, it's just we always gonna be. Right. But you be flirting with Cam though a little bit though. Like y'all be flirting. Oh, no, 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 we talking about trusting. Okay. All right. So let me ask you a question. Why you just never got your brother to beat Cam up? They in two different cities. My brother ain't never been in Houston. He could come to Houston. Mm -hmm. I'm, just my, I'm just saying, like, if it was now. that, right. But it was like, my brother got a whole child. He can't just up and go to Houston whenever I do. Because I up and go. I don't give no plan out. I just up and go. My brother got a whole child. He's not finna up and go four hours away. But I mean, if it was ever that, my, my brother. Okay. Was yeah, no, I really don't care about them being on my top. I don't care. I just didn't understand that. It was just like, damn, once the once my nephew get involved and or niece or whatever it is, I'm straight just going to find you. Like, I don't know. But listen, you shouldn't want to put harm's way in your brother's perspective. Like, you shouldn't want to put harm's way when it comes to your brother. So that I understand. But um, it's just like, damn, sometimes I forget that you do have a brother. And it's like, damn, especially if somebody say, I'm going to get my sister to slap you. I would be like, let me call my brother then. Like, it ain't going to give that. Like, you be going to Houston like you don't got no siblings. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what does me going to Houston got anything to do with my siblings, though? No, what I'm saying is that these people be saying that they're going to get you beat up and jumped. Mm -hmm. But have they? No, but the thing okay. about it is So what's the need of calling my brother if it ain't never happened? Well, Nadia, you don't interfere, though. So that's it's like you sometimes pick and choose. Like, you, mm -hmm. like I'll hear them say, oh, I'm going to get somebody to slap you. And you don't mm -hmm. say, who you going to get the slap? Get him. So, get him. Oh, like, you don't on. say none of that. You hold just, like, on, rush on. off. I turned around. I asked who, but they said she wasn't on that. So I dropped it and kept on walking. Then Cam turned and he was like, now nah, I'm just talking. I'm just talking. Uh -uh, okay, so what about Le what about Lexi? Who is Lexi? What she said? Lexi, you know who Lexi is, girl. You just said yeah. she got a whole yeah, baby yeah, yeah. to worry said? about. What you she said say? what? What did she say? She, she, she said she got her money on Oreo if it come down to it. What the fuck does that got to do with me, though? Like, what do you, I mean, I'm confused. She texted me saying she was just kidding. <laughs> like, I'm Oh, confused. she texted you saying she was just playing? She was just kidding. I said, yeah, okay. Oh, Lexi. <laughs> like, Lexi, I, I'm not come understand. on, Lexi. trying to be plot. You, nobody going to take my whole car. Y'all should know that, though. They oh, Lexi, come on, girl. You can't be going around saying no stuff like that. Like, is there certain shit it. people expect me to feel hit about? I'm never going to feel hit about it. Like, okay, you said that. I said something. You text me saying you was playing. So at the mm. end of the day, what's really there to feel hit about? Mm. So. Well, we got to close that one up because Lexi copping for you. So I didn't know about that. So, um, yeah, this is outrageous, boy. I don't know where else to go with this. I honestly don't know. Like, you know, even Aima, I thought you and I. 
Thought y'all was going to fight, but y'all didn't. But hey. Right, because she called me before I went to the club and she said it was dead. Again, cop and please, right? And I got the I got the whole conversation. So don't try to take my whole card because there's always been conversations dropped before I ever see anybody in person. Also, oh, Naima called you cop and please? She did. She called Ida, cop and please. They cool, cool. And then she, where's Nadia? I'm right there. No, myself. she didn't. Shut do up. Want, do you want the voice? I'm confused. What is there? No, mind? she didn't. Oh, Naima, you got on Beagle. Naima, why would you get on Beagle and you tell? Oh, let me. And I, I knew she would. I mean, I got the whole. Like, no, she did. She did. She did. Exactly. That's <laughs> and that comes to show. I see where I stand with people, and it's no trust. It's just cool. You want to be cordial? We can be cordial. Same section, but I'm not gonna trust you though. That's why I recorded the shit. Don't copy. Oh, really Naima, Naima didn't. I'm in here listening to the live. That hoe is Kevin. That hoe know when I see her next time, I'm gonna whoop her ass. <laughs> I hope she can hear me. I hope she knows. <laughs> Bitch, the shit that you pulled at that motherfucking club, bitch, and Ooh. you sit here and text the day while you left the club Ooh. and you wanted to leave early, bitch, I'm going to wear your ass out when I see you, bitch. That's I spared really you when I went to that club. I'm not uh -huh. spared you this time. Stop getting on this live cast, bitch. When I see you, it's, uh -huh. it's going to be that. So make sure you at right. that motherfucking event next Friday because I'm uh -huh. going to be there, bitch. Uh -huh. And when I see you, I'm smacking the shit out of you. Right. Point, like, period. And how many times have you said this and you called my phone cop and please? Who called your okay. Call okay. Your girl, bitch, and is your nigga telling you the same thing? Because as soon as I found out you was coming to the club, I was on it, and I put that on your dead ass baby, and I put that on uh -huh. my dead brother, uh -huh. bitch. When I see you, uh -huh. bitch, I'm smacking the shit out of you, bitch, and it's that. Right. Bitch, I'm not, stop, stop coming up here lying, bitch. Stop coming up here talking, uh -huh. please. Bitch, ain't nobody scared of your ass, bitch. Right. What you about? So you wasn't just on my phone crying, saying nobody, how you wish you never said nothing about my baby. Please, do you want me to play? Do you want me to play the message? Please, please be for real. Do you want me to play the message? For real. Who is you for me to copy please to? Do you want me to play the message? It's a yes or no. Girl, I don't give a fuck if you play no message. Okay, best friend, hand me the iPad and I go to the voice message. Can I ask for you because your fucking friend told me not to do nothing because we was in the club. Let's. Let's be fucking for real. Ain't nobody scared right. your ass, bitch. Anyway, so we not waiting until next Friday. I'm going to Atlanta on we, Tuesday. We uh, your nigga dropped the act the same day he was in the Now you get on TikTok because this is this this phone is about to die and this phone is on a charger. Is he fucking that bitch tripping? Get, get on. This is crazy. Your nigga get dropped your act the day we was in the club. Nah, get on the get in the request. Okay, let me leave. So so what we doing? Because we tired of y'all two arguing one day. Like, is y'all going to rumble? Like, what's what's up? Like, she was At the end of the day, it was that. Until she got in my phone, copping a plea. She can, she can so why sit and lie all she want. I got the voice recording. So why you text? Hmm? So look, this was the real tea. I told y'all I was going to come, y'all. I knew, I already knew about it. I just respect boundaries. So look, Nadia, mm -hmm. why you text? They talk about some advantage mode that you need to, you really his. Mm -hmm. Right, so let's get into that because again, niggas is only gonna send certain messages. So boom, hold on, I got my no oh, jar shit. Okay, get us some water. So, get us some Gatorade. Or okay, so, so my mouth is not that fucking jar. Okay, go. okay, so damn, I won't even. Because mm. okay. you text okay. day advantage mode saying how he was really yours. And mm -hmm. you and Naima not being loyal, she got niggas in the section. Right. And mm -hmm. like, can I just long story short it? Go ahead, but we know you know we love a detail. You ain't doing nothing but getting your eyelashes done. She get it. We will get it. Matter of fact, wrong. we gotta give the last check a tip because she she's stressing out. <laughs> okay, hold on. Okay, so. Damn, okay, so fast. Okay, before we even went to the club, da da da. I was getting my hair done. And they had called my phone. He was like, something. Okay, he had ran into somebody cool. He was just letting me know that da, 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 we was talking. Okay, cool. So that's when, because me and Dave was not talking. We was not talking. We haven't talked in I don't know how long until he called my phone. He called me off his friend phone. So that's kind of how we started back, you know, getting into communication. Okay, cool. The day of the club, Dave had texted me and he was. <sighs> He was basically, he was just, okay, flirting. Okay, cool. So then he was like, um, he said something as in like, why, if the first time that me and me and Naima had got into it about uh, when they got caught cheating on Messi Maj, da, 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 he was basically saying like, oh, like, why don't you just, ba <sighs> oh my God. I really don't want to though. Like, I Say it, say it all. This is no spearing. 
Talk about it. Be about it. Act about it. Talk about it. It's Nadia. Still a T. Oh my, okay, no, I'm just gonna say this. Okay, her nigga was in my phone way before we even made it to the club. Okay, what? so when we had got there, and he had he had said something in between the lines of like, why didn't uh, some, 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 and I was like, oh, well, I mean, if motherfuckers were respecting y'all relationship, then it would have been that, but it just shows like, y'all seen it, it's, he screenshotted it or took a picture of it, something, and I said, he know where home at, because at the end of the day, never other one was being fucking loyal, okay, mm -hmm. so. That's just basically what I was saying. Now, damn, like, <laughs> okay, so boom, we at the club, cool. Um, 